Seven free websites plus one paid, but it's great. Websites that you definitely need because they're great and I have found them for you and you should take advantage of them because they'll make your life much, much easier. Right, so the first website I want to show you is tryhackme.com. Tryhackme is free and is one of the best basically websites you can get started with because it's a beginner friendly website. It has hundreds and hundreds of levels that you can just choose from and get going, right? And also has information levels, so it's just not challenges. It has information levels and basically anything from cybersecurity to hacking to blue teaming or SOC or basically anything you can think of, right? And to get the discount also basically because Try Hack Me also, just like Hack the Box, which I'm going to explain in a second, gives you student discounts for um, basically the better levels. I think it's like 30-40% off. All you need to do is just sign up with your student ID email, right? That's all you need to do. And then it gives you a 30-40% discount for forever, as long as you have that email, right? So something to take an advantage of, definitely you should. Now, the second venture I'm going to say, I know it's paid. Hack the Box is unfortunately paid. However, it has a student discount. So if you sign up with your basically student email, it will give you a, I think it's like a 30-40% discount, so make sure to sign up. Now, Hack the Box, the reason I'm mentioning Hack the Box, even though it's not a free website, is because it's it's a powerful, powerful website. It teaches you the actual hacking skills you need, and it's basically very, very good. Now, also, as you can see, basically, it's very, very popular because University of Sydney, EA Sports, Toyota, and Intel, and very, very multi-billion companies work with Hack the Box, which sort of gives it good credibility. So if you're interested and basically if you have experience and you're ready to sort of get started with real hacking, make sure to check out Hack the Box. It's a very, very good website. Right, so the next website I want to show you guys is Pico CTF. This is the fourth website I want to show you and it's obviously it's free. Now, it's actually, this website is very, very uncommon. However, this website is absolutely free, which means you should sort of take an advantage of it. And this website obviously is a cybersecurity website. It teaches you basically exploitation and um, some basically sort of critical skills, thinking skills. So basically it teaches you basically cryptography, web exploitation, forensics, binary exploitation, reversing, and much more. I can't really remember because I haven't used this website in ages and um, because I don't have time. But obviously because this is a free website, you should definitely, definitely take advantage of it. As you can see, there's some, also they mention some external resources. So just check it out, sign up. If you don't like it, don't like it, but I'm giving you a free website. I think you should still check it out because it's cool. Now, fourth website and my favorite website, I love this website, is Portswigger or Borpsy Academy. This website, it teaches you basically very, very good exploitation skills and it also teaches you sort of the possibilities and what's possible to exploit and basically teaches the exploitation skills. So I've showed you this website before, right? So it teaches you server-side vulnerabilities, SQL injection, API testing, file upload vulnerabilities, one of my favorite um, exploitation methods. Um, it also teaches you path traversal, again, one of my favorite. And it also teaches you SSRF, so server-side request forgery. I'll be showing you lots of content about SSRF in the future. But um, as I said, it's a free website. You should definitely check it out and basically teaches you quite a lot. Now, also, another beautiful website, I've showed you this website as well before, is hackedthissite.org. It's a very, very beautiful website, and it's actually pretty old. This website is, I would say, good for resources and challenges right so it's sort of like just like any other website i don't know why i said that uh, yeah but basically it gives you challenges so we have basic realistic application programming javascript also teaches you javascript forensic extended basic steg steganography and um, very very uh, good word and get informed so very good very good information useful stuff you can also help this website out so if you want to donate, you can donate to the website, uh, up to you if you want to donate, and much, much more. Now, this website, if I'm not wrong, is pretty old. I think it's like maybe 10, 20 years old. I'm not really sure, but it's pretty old, um, sort of, you can tell by the design and stuff. It's pretty old, but a very, very good website. Make sure to check it out. Now, another website, but I don't think it's actually that popular anymore. I don't know. I've not really seen anybody mention Von Hub. But Von Hub is a, basically, it distributes virtual machines. It's made by people for people, right? So people make vulnerable virtual, uh, virtual machines, so it allows you to exploit them. And basically, this is how you learn practical skills, thinking skills, and exploitation skills. So if you want to get hands-on hands, hands-on uh, hands, hands skills, I think that makes sense. If you want to get hands-on hands skills, I don't think that's how you say it, hands-on hands-on practice, whatever, just whatever, doesn't fucking matter, right? If you want to basically get some good 
um, virtual machines that basically give you practical skills and if you want to learn stuff make sure to check it out the one sort of machine i can recommend is i think it's mr robot here yeah mr robot very good machine and one of the sort of machines i love is basic pen test because it allows you to basically pen test the basic pen testing this is very good this is the virtual machine i used in lots of my videos because it's very very simple and it's pretty easy to explain, which allows me to basically do easy explaining to you guys right so if you want if you if you're just getting started in cyber security make sure to download this uh, virtual machine get it started it's easy just to make sure to download your obviously this will be your wi-fi just to make yourself secure now another website i want to show you and it's a search engine wow right it's google google.com is very very important you need to be able to google stuff properly when i was learning hacking i was going sort of wrong and i was making myself um, going insane and I was making stuff much much harder than me than it had to be because I wasn't googling stuff properly because I thought googling stuff is weak and is stupid uh, no it's not it's everyone google stuff everyone takes stuff off github everyone takes stuff off exploit db it's normal right internet is a it's a resource it's an ocean of resources therefore we need to utilize it properly to become very good hackers right so if i want to for example let's look for let's look for the actual vulnerability that's been trending right so palo alto cve 2024 3, uh, 3400 right so as you can see it's a cve 2024 300 3400 right so now we know there's a cve that affects certain version of certain and um, palo alto software right now, if you want to get a POC or a sort of code or how to exploit it, you need to type in, for example, GitHub, right? And then it should give you a CVE with GitHub or some, some kind of code. As you can see, there's a HTTP request that is basically um, vulnerable or allows you to exploit this, right? So it is important that you learn how to Google stuff properly and be patient with your searches. Now the next website, and this is basically my top one visited websites whenever I'm doing anything. If I'm doing pen testing, if I'm doing, if I'm doing CTFs, this is my number one website, right? I visit GitHub for everything. If I need an exploit, I use GitHub. If I need POC, proof of concept, I use GitHub. If I need any SQL injection payloads, if I need local LFI, local inflation award list or a file, I use GitHub because GitHub is a pool of resources, right? It's the second most powerful engine, just like Google. For example, right, let's actually know, I'm going to change it. Let's, let's do SQL injection payloads, right? And the thing is, yeah, you get GitHub, right? Well, actually, this is the first search. That's good. Let's go on GitHub, right? And the thing is, First of all, as you can see, this guy is very kind. Oh, actually, payload box. That's a very good, um, I think he's a developer or something. He's a very good guy. He basically explains the different types of SQL injection. But apart from that, he gives you the payloads, right? So you can just take this stuff, right, from here, from, for example, Intruder that's designed for Burp Suite. You can take the payload and download it and put it on your, wherever you want take the stuff and use it for yourself, right? So this is, GitHub is one of the best things for hackers, right? Because it gives you so much stuff and so much, basically, opportunities and exploits and resources that you just, you cannot imagine. You'll find anything you want, I would suggest putting GitHub, right? So if you're looking for anything, let's do LFI payloads, right? And put GitHub at the end or at the start. Because it will give you the what the stuff you want, it will give you it will give you it straight straight away, right? As, as you can see, right? So it gives you just so much stuff. As you can see, also gives you this guy decided to be kind and also gives you sort of um encoded, right? So it bypasses certain stuff. I'm actually gonna download this in a second because this is a very, very good word list. So that'll be it. So I hope you basically find these eight websites very useful. I do recommend checking all of them out. They're great. If you want to learn hacking the fastest way and learn it from me and learn basically with extra detail, make sure to check out my Udemy course, which will be in the description below. I find I think there's still a discount running, so make sure to check your course now. Don't forget to check out my other videos, which will are in playlists. So if you want to learn networking, cybersecurity, ethical hacking, Kali Linux, whatever you really want, 
every single video is in a playlist, so just make sure to check all of them out.